ask you about the reviews because one musician that keeps that I've seen mentioned a couple times when this record is discussed yeah. is Prince. Yeah. Um, and being in Minneapolis, yeah. I, I would I just was thought it'd be cool to ask you about Prince and if there was any influence that he had on this record and just your overall feelings about him mm -hmm. since we're in his hometown. Mm -hmm. You know, it's interesting because I didn't grow up listening to Prince really. I mean, as a sort of like. I mean, I obviously was very aware of Prince, but uh, I really only started to get into his music when I was in my early 20s. And I immediately gravitated towards, you know, certain certain material in his catalog. And I found them to be really enjoyable songs to do covers of and to play. And it's it sounds sounds strange, but like from a listener's perspective, I didn't I didn't always feel drawn to the production. And it's really out there. Like, I mean, it's just like crazy music. But when you actually sit down with the song and strip it down to its like bare like lyrics and just chords, I mean, he's a genius. And the songs are such a pleasure. They're sort of uh, they're surprising and exciting to play. And so I started to really, really respect him in a way that I, you know, I, I guess I didn't when I was younger. And uh, it's total shock that he that he died. And it sort of feels like a real it's just a real sad year for losing some of the biggest, you know, some of the biggest influences in our life. Anyways, David Actually, Bowie being another one. And what's very strange about Minneapolis is that pretty much every time you play a show here when you're a traveling band, someone a rumor will get started that prince is going to come to your show and i'm i'm not joking when i say like multiple times when we came through minneapolis there was a rumor that prince was going to be there and we would laugh because we're like as if but um it was still like one of those things where it was like you know just crazy mad respect and and excitement when you thought that prince might show up at your show and we actually had multiple people who have worked for us have worked for prince and um, had only heard really, really fascinating and interesting things about him and just what a creative genius he was and just how incredibly involved he was in everything. And just, um, yeah, both feel very, very, very sad, but also just so grateful for all the music that he put out into the world. Do you know what? Also, too, I just wanted to say one other thing about Prince. You know, most people, like most artists, I imagine, go home like I do and like just put like sweats on and like watch like Bravo and eat like macaroni and cheese out of the box. Like we're all kind of just like legitimately basic. And it's that's what I know most artists really are like. Mm -hmm. But like one thing that was interesting about having people who worked for Prince and like live on the compound and like the whole thing, he's just like not putting sweatpants on and eating Annie's mac and cheese. Like that just Prince is not doing that. He's living life. Always. Yeah. He's, he's always, always an artist. Living. He's always yeah. the artist. Always yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's always he was always, 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 always that guy, at least in front of other people. And like I have respect for that. <laughs> it was blueberry pancakes for him. It wasn't mac and yeah. cheese. That's what it was. But even yeah. that, that is a complex meal to make. I mean, like when are they done? We I mean, don't know. A, he was a complex musician yeah, so complex the, the the how 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 much you heat up the, the blueberry and the pancake is very challenging but annie's mac and cheese very basic easy meal yeah he didn't i don't think he did much of that and yeah. in fact when <laughs> when uh there was a bunch of like murals and people going to paisley park after he passed away just a lot of bisquick and a lot of uh, really yeah, people left pancake mix <laughs> oh my gosh it's so kind of funny. like the the peanut butter and uh banana elvis presley thing it's the same thing yeah, yeah. very similar very okay. similar a lot of bisquick and a lot of uh, really yeah, people left pancake mix <laughs> oh my gosh it's kind so of funny. like the the peanut butter and uh banana elvis presley thing it's the same thing yeah, yeah. very similar very okay. similar